plan what they need to do and how they need to do it. It costs them nothing. If you have a friend or you know someone that is currently living with an abusive situation, I ask you today to please have them call or walk in, they don't need an appointment, at 753 Fairfield Avenue, the corner of Park in Fairfield, and one of our victim advocates will help them and we will provide every service they need to become safe and self-sufficient. That's what I ask of you today. Thank you. The family, the family Justice Center ought to be the first call that families struggling call. It could save your life. Ron Pinciaro, Connecticut's, uh, Connecticut Center Against Gun Violence. Thank you, Mayor Finch. And we're all tremendously saddened that uh, two more young lives, 23 and 24 year old, uh, have been lost this weekend. And we can only come here as your community and give those injured and anguished families our deepest respect and compassion and promise to try harder, as we have been doing, to stop the gun violence. Crimes reverberate through years and through lives, and it's the rare homicides that affects, affect only one person. So what have we been doing? We've heard about Project Longevity. Uh, just last week, a task force of New Haven and um, Bridgeport law enforcement um, took 73 illegal guns off the street, um, started the process of arrest and conviction of 150 people who were uh, trafficking guns and drugs. Uh, so we're doing stuff. 75% um, of the gun homicides in Connecticut happen in the three largest cities of Bridgeport, Hartford, and New Haven. In 2011, there were 75 gun homicides in those three cities. In 2012, it dropped to 56. In 2013, last year, it dropped to 50. This year, so far, there have been 15 in those three cities. Um, so it, what we're doing so far is working. It didn't help us this weekend. We lost two lives. That's two, two too many. But even with those two, Bridgeport has had, had only three this year. I say only, we know that's too many. Um, but things have been working. What are we going to do next? Um, on, the, on the domestic violence front, for instance, Connecticut is one of only two states 